Hello Taurus, welcome to my channel, welcome back to uh, my channel for some of you guys, hope you guys are doing well. Uh, guys feel free to jump ahead to the start of the reading, it is time stamped. Okay, so if you click in the uh, description bar below, see where it says start reading, click on that and uh, that will bring you to the uh, start of the reading. This section is really for those that just kind of prefer to see me shuffle on camera. Okay, all right. Okay, so I'm just going to take these in and I'll be back. So Taurus, let's start your reading. All right, so it seems like um, in the past, you. it seems like, let's start with the seven, because we do have the seven of pentacles and the eight on your spread, on your side. So we kind of, it, there's work. You, your, your focus is on kind of putting work into this relationship, moving this ahead, moving this forward. Wasn't moving as quickly as you'd like um, based on what you was putting in. And that's due to this person having to have this person waiting on something. There's something that they had to wait on. It's like they made a decision regarding you. They know that they wanted to move forward with you. You, you know, I feel like a conversation was definitely had regarding that. But it seems like there was something that they had to wait on. Um, could be, and this is not for all of you, of course, could be maybe divorce papers, something that they was committed to before, prior. Uh, but something that they they have knowledge around or something that they had to wait on. Not sure what it was, what it is. I don't think you're privy to that as well. I feel like this person might have mentioned it to you. But yeah, I don't feel like all was disclosed. Something definitely that they had to wait on. But I feel like that information is coming now though with that eight of, of wands there. So whatever it is that they was waiting on in the past they've had to or it's coming now for them so we've got the eight of of cups sorry eight of wands there which kind of gives them permission to focus on now moving this ahead with the magician you know really kind of putting in putting their focus really on this relationship on you uh, where you guys are going spending time together all of that good stuff putting in with that star card there for you though it's kind of left you confused um, there's a bit of confusion here for you with that seven of cups. Yes, you do want to move this ahead towards that nine, of course. But I feel like the the fact that you don't know what was going on for them is kind of taking up real estate in your brain with that eight to the point where you're on the verge of really having it consume your mind and your focus. You're not happy or let's scrap the word happy, you're not kind of comfortable, you're not really feeling comfortable not knowing what it is that was going on for them, what was the hold up, it's like what was it, I don't feel like it's anything major, I feel like this person, because we do have the um, ace of wands there, sorry the ace of swords, we've got the eight, the knight of cups, what am I doing, and we've got the three of pentacles, so Definitely something that they needed to sort out in order for them to move ahead, but they couldn't do it. I mean, the three represents collaboration coming together. The night represents just slow moving. Um, and then we've got the idea, solution with the Ace of Swords. So definitely something that they had to do before they can actually move ahead with you. If it's not something like divorce papers or anything like that, it could be simply having a conversation with someone it could be it could be anything I don't feel like it's something that you have to know about um yeah I just feel like this person chose to deal with that or has been choosing to deal with that by their self not wanting to kind of involve you in that because there is no need it's like I'm keep hearing this on a need to know basis on a need to know basis yeah, but for you, it's like, well, you know, let me pull on this because there must be more what's going on for you in terms of why you feel the need to know. What, what, is, what is bothering you about not knowing? 
there's no three of cups here. I don't feel like it's a third party situation or anything like that. I just feel like this person, I mean, the focus is on you. The focus is on the relationship. I feel like they're now in a space where they're free enough to be able to move ahead with this. So there really is no point, Taurus, in even wanting to know or trying to know. It's just something that they had to deal with. I feel like you, got, you should focus on, I get why you want to, um, We've got the four, sorry, the four, the King of Cups here, which talks about stability. That's something that you want to offer, uh, or you continue to offer, but there's some form of realization about some form of, is there, do you think, I mean, there's a Queen of Swords here. So I feel like for some of you, you think that there's a person who has this type of energy. The Queen of Swords energy is very manipulative, controlling. So I feel like there's some person around this that you might tie to this person or you might think that there's some form of um, connection to this person and it's tied to their hold up. And that's adding to this, this Eight of Swords, which is going to cause you to maybe just pull back on giving as much as you've been given with this person. I feel like you're jumping to conclusions. I'm going to put it out there now. I really do. <clears throat> um... You know, because I just don't, I just don't, yeah. I tell you what's going to happen. I'm just going to pull on that four as well. I tell you what's going to happen. The further you, and I'm just going to keep it honest with you, Taurus. The further you um, fall into this space where you're, you know, you just can't stop thinking about why, or, you know, wanting to know, um, that's going to be expressed in some way. And what's going to happen is, is this person's just not going to be in the, the space to want to deal with that. It's like, I just don't want to deal with that. You know, I don't want to deal with that. And then their focus is going to start to be on, you know, the negative and not moving this ahead because they want to establish something with you. You know, if I'm honest with you, Taurus, I feel like you could be treading on, I don't want to say thin ice, uh, heading into territories you don't need to. Yeah, I really do. I feel like you should just focus on where this connection is now because it's their, their, their space is free enough to be able to proceed with this. Focus there. Um, focus on where you guys are going. Um, and enjoy the ride. You know, enjoy the ride. Uh, so hopefully this is giving you some form of clarity. For those of you who don't know, I do weekly singles and love readings. Um, have a beautiful, beautiful day. And I shall see you next week.